I had gone to visit the grave of a friend of mine And as I walked through the graveyard I noticed this man kneeling down by the grave of a child And in his hand he held a big red rose And tears were streaming down his cheeks I walked over and laid a hand on his shoulder and started to talk to him And during the course of our conversation And in his broken English this is the story just as he told it to me. He said, Mister, I'm a walker down the street of today and I pass by a bigger flower shop. I walk in and I ask the man in the shop, I say, Boss, how much are for one red rose? And he looked at me with one a bigger frown and he said, I want a dollar, please. But then the by and the by, a swell addressed a blonde young lady walk in and she says, How much are for one red rose? And he looked at her with one of biggest smile, and he said, a ten of cents. And I said, a boss, how come are you charging me a dollar for the rose, and you charge the young lady only ten of cents? And he says, oh, look, mister, you tell me why you want the rose, and maybe I'll give it to you for not. And I said, a boss, I'm a hard work man, working the railroad and only make a three dollar a day. And I got a little girl, and her name is Rosa. Rose is just about this a high boss. Every day when I come home from work, a little Rose would come running to meet her papa. She throw her little arms around my neck and say, Papa, and I say, Rosa. But the one a day, a boss, I come home from work and I don't see Rosa. I look her down by the railroad track and I see one a bigger crowd. I go down and I push the crowd this way and I push the crowd that way and there boss sit my feet, lay my little Rosa. And that's why I want the rose, boss. I want to put him on a little rose's grave. The man, he don't have said not. But he picked the biggest and the reddest rose. And he give it to me. And I say, thank you, boss. Thank you very much. And though she's gone, you see, she's still the world to me. To me she'll always be that little girl 